Welcome! In this quick tip video, we will show you how to install a component mechanical seal in the stuffing box in one of Viking Pump's internal gear pumps with the u bracket. Before installing the new seal, ensure the shaft is free of any debris or wear. Install the seal installation sleeve with the taper toward the end of the shaft. Lubricate the shaft and install the rotary member of the mechanical seal. Remember to remove the seal installation sleeve. Before reaching the bracket bore, remove the four seal clips to engage the seal. Finish installing the seal until the set screws line up with the seal access hole in the bracket. Insert a hex head wrench into a set screw to keep the seal from sliding as you complete the rest of the installation. Next, place the PTFE gasket around the stationary seal seat and slide onto the shaft. Install the gasket into the seal holder and slide onto the shaft. Insert the T-bolts and install the lock nuts, but do not fully tighten at this time. Install the half round rings. Install the bearing spacer collar with the cup side over the half round rings. Install the bearing housing and fully tighten until the shaft will not turn. This point is known as zero end clearance. Install the lock washer by aligning the tab through the slot on the shaft. Install the lock nut. Place a brass or hardwood bar into the port opening to keep the pump from turning. Torque the lock nut to the appropriate torque setting. This setting can be found in the technical service manual. Bend a tang of the lock washer into a slot of the lock nut. If no tang aligns, continue to tighten the lock nut until one does. Failure to tighten the lock nut or engage the lock washer tab could result in early bearing failure and cause damage to the rest of the pump. You can now set the end clearance. The end clearance setting can be found in the technical service manual. Please refer to our video, Setting End Clearance, for details on this procedure. You can now set the seal. Confirm that the seal set screws are aligned with the seal access hole. Tighten each set screw until it just contacts the shaft. Then fully tighten each set screw. Next, fully tighten the seal holder lock nuts. Turn the shaft to ensure the pump turns freely. Using appropriate thread sealant, install plugs into the seal access holes. To see the complete disassembly, seal installation, and final assembly, visit our website at vikingpump.com.